Chris, what is important about Occupy for you? Um, Occupy Youngstown. Here we are February the 23rd, 2013, and we've had almost a year and a half since our inception in 2011. I think our goals are still the same. We um, definitely want to use that spirit of Occupy to continue to help people who are going through foreclosures, um, to uh, do the Food Not Bombs project that we started last year, that's Feeding the Homeless, um, and various other activities. Right now, the important one, though, is, of course, Frack Free Mahoning, um, trying to get enough signatures for the um, citizens' uh, rights. Um, citizens, they just... Oh, what is that name of that? Citizens' Rights Initiative? Uh, yeah, Citizens' Rights. Just a fairly new, new uh, an acronym that they had. Gosh, that. Anyways, the Citizens' uh, Bill of Rights. That's yes. it. Yeah, Citizens' Bill of Rights. Thank you. Um, and getting fracking eliminated from the city of Youngstown. We really need to let our politicians know in uh, so many ways, with so many avenues, that we want clean water, we want clean air, we don't want big trucks going through our streets, and we don't want the power of corporations to continue to dominate us the way that they have. Um, I guess the only other thing that um, is really significant now in February to think about is uh, gardening and local produce, which of course everybody will be starting to dig up the garden pretty soon. Um, we're on a um, uh, also a campaign right now to stop the GMOs. We want to make sure that people know about Monsanto, how it is modifying the fruits, vegetables that we eat, um, and going back to the local system of uh, food production and how much healthier that that is for us as individuals and how much better it is for the earth. I think I've covered everything.